In this video, I will show you how to fix this error if you are receiving this when you're trying to play Valorant, which is the D3, D11 compatible GPU error. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are on my desktop. Now, the first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that your system is up to date. To do this, come down to the bottom left hand corner, click onto the search box and just go ahead and put updates into the search box. Underneath best match, you then want to click on to check for updates. And what it's going to do is load up a window like this, the Windows Update window. So it's just going to take a minute to load through. As you can see, in my case, I'm currently up to date, but you can check for updates if you want by clicking this button here. And if there's any updates available, what it's going to do is download those for you. So if you do have any updates available, what you want to do is first of all, update your system and then go ahead and shut down your PC and restart it. After doing this, the next thing you're going to want to do is to update your graphics drivers. Now to do this, again, come down to the search box in the bottom left hand corner. And in the search box this time, you want to go ahead and put device manager. Again, underneath this match, click onto device manager. And from here, what you're going to want to look for is display adapters, which is this one here. So just go ahead and click the arrow next to this, and that's going to bring up your graphics card. Next, what you're going to want to do is right click onto your graphics card and go ahead and click the update driver button. Now go ahead and click search automatically for drivers. And as you can see, in my case, again, the best drivers for your device are already installed. So if you don't have the most up to date drivers, it's going to give you the option to update your drivers. And the third and final thing that you want to do is actually download DirectX 12. So to do this, what you want to do is open up a new browser and then come across to google.com. And what you can then do is in the search box, you just want to go ahead and type DirectX 12. So DirectX is one word like this, click 12 and hit enter. And what you want to do is download this from the Microsoft website, which is this one here. So you want to go ahead and click onto this and that's going to take you directly to the download page. So that's now downloaded. So what you want to do is come down to your search box, go ahead and type downloads to open up your downloads folder. And then what you can do is run the setup for DirectX. So I'm just going to go ahead and run it from here. So here's the setup wizard. So what you would do is just go ahead, accept the agreement and go through. You can, uh, you don't have to install this. It just gives you the option to install the Bing bar if you want to, but you can untick that if you want. Click next. And that's going to go ahead and install the most up to date version of DirectX 12. So that's now all done. So once you've finished all those steps, again, what you want to do is just go ahead and restart your computer. And now if you go ahead and try and stop Valorant, you should be able to play without experiencing that error. So I hope this tutorial helped you out today. And if it did, I would really appreciate it. If you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.